Well, my name is Paul Andrew Ulysses Lamb, and my initials spell Paul, hence the P-A-U-L. That is my true name. I've had it all my life. A little neighborhood, a little blue collar community, east side of Detroit City called Harper Road. That's where the music is born and bred. I grew up in Detroit, as I was saying. Hugely influenced by Motown and a real urban sound, a lot of funk. Uh, heavily into bands like Funkadelic, which are from Detroit. Truly taught me showmanship more than anything. It's kind of an amalgamation of uh, just years of traveling and living in different places that I believe has created my style of music. Be making records as often as I am, and uh, it's the greatest form of self expression. It's been quite a journey. Um, every album is, a, is, is a, a whole new expression of where you're at and why you're at for the moment and the ideas that you're cultivating because it's just a split second in time. It's an iota of time where you're giving it your all. Some nights you're on, some nights you're off. That's just the nature of the beast. But it definitely, it's a constant reinvention of yourself. inspiration for this record, I really went back a lot of it to like feelings I had in, in childhood and growing up in Detroit and I really wanted to make a record that represented my, my roots, my personal roots and where I come from. All the songs on this record represent uh, what I was after. I had originally demoed out almost 30 songs and we whittled it down to the 10 that made the record. Detroit is on fire is you know a prime example of growing up in the auto industry and where the auto industry is at now. The title track Gunshot Lullaby, the token rock ballad on the record, speaks from a place that's very dear to my childhood. I didn't choose music, you know, music chose me, and so I'm in it. It's a life, it's an, it's an amazing life.